I haven't done any updates this year um, with any of my growing. I've got leeks on the go. It's pretty warm in here already. It's only just gone eight, nine o'clock, something like that. Got cauliflowers coming on. Loads of leeks. I have got. Oh, I've got to remember. What I've got summer cabbages, red kale, sugar snap peas, spinach coming on, rainbow chard, purple beetroot. In here I've got the odd lettuce coming through. I've got green and pale green courgettes on the go there. In here I've got French beans on the go. If I just peel that out you can see some of those are just coming through and then yesterday I sowed this this is golden sweet corn uh, not golden sweet corn golden beetroot I've only just got up um, yeah so no hotbed this year I've not used the compost from last year from the hotbed which is still in there I'm gonna use that on one of the beds um, I don't have the field area this year, someone else is using that, the nephew of the owners. Um, I do have a third allotment this year now, so in a way it's a bit of a blessing because I've got all my growing area, uh, probably a bigger area now than I did have last year, all literally in one place. All of my allotments are in a line, literally with a four foot path separating each one. Um, I'm going to focus more on a lot more food this year for obvious reasons. Um, we're still on lockdown, so I'm having to do a lot at the allotments in a short space of time, which has meant no diggers had to go out of the window this year, uh, which I'm a bit sort of mm about. Um, I've been over prepping areas as quick as I could and rotivating. I can't get at my huge compost heap, which is still over at the field. Um, purely because of the time scales of things. <coughs> I don't see this lockdown ending anytime soon. Um, that's a partial lockdown. Um, I think what's going to happen is we'll have at least another three week extension and then on from there. China has had I think about 80, 80 something days of lockdown. We're going to have to have the same because we've not nipped it in the bud the same way. But later this year I think food is going to run short. Um, so even if it doesn't, I want to be well ahead. So this year I'm really going to up my game again, like I did a couple of three years ago maybe, and really get stuff going. I've got carrots on the go over at the allotments. Plot one has still got stuff in. I'm still harvesting leek. There's still beetroot, although they're going to go to seed soon. I've got broad beans, garlic, overwinter and onions all now starting to really come on really well. I'll maybe pop a few photos on the end. Um, and and uh, if I do, you'll get to see where we're at. Um, the third plot is almost ready to sow into or plant into. The second plot over there is still untidy. I'm really fighting with that every single year. I had about six years of someone not doing much at all with it. So it's taken me years to get on top of it, which I knew it would. But yeah, um, who knows what the rest of this year is going to hold. Things are very strange this year.